Forever and a Day is a new documentary about the Scorpions that gives a close-up look at one of the world's most successful rock bands. The story isn't just for fans, it's exciting for people who've never even had access to the Scorpions or our music. The 100-minute film features numerous performances from the German rockers, like this one in Paris. Forever and a Day also gives the audience a peek behind the scenes and an insight into singer Klaus Meine's personal life with his wife Gabi. Quite rightly, Gabi says, we could do something nice together, but you've left all your energy out there on the street. I just get the leftovers. That's the way it is, unfortunately. The band formed in Hanover in 1965 but new beginnings aren't always plain sailing. I needed equipment and it didn't come cheap. So my mother took me out and said, okay then, we'll get a loan. Filming began in 2011 during the Scorpions' farewell tour. They were actually planning their departure from the stage. The film crew accompanied the band around the world for three years. Tour stops included the US, France and Thailand. But at the end of 2012 came some good news. The Scorpions live on. At the airports, we saw fans holding flowers and with tears in their eyes, and we realized what we meant to them. James Kotak was still the Scorpions drummer at the time of filming. But he's since been replaced due to health reasons by ex-Motorhead drummer Mickey D. Rocky like a hurricane. Forever and a Day is directed by Katja van Gagny. It's already celebrated its premiere in the cinema and will be screened as a two-parter on TV. The Scorpions like you've never seen them before.